We're recording. Hello, I'm Paul Vanuk from Recording Magazine. Welcome to our latest video review. Today, we're taking a look at the RME Fireface UFX3, a USB 3 audio interface, which I also reviewed in the June 2023 issue of Recording Magazine. For the past 27 years, RME has been at the forefront of audio interface technology, from digital conversion all the way to streaming audio. They've covered all of the rapidly changing protocols from PCI all the way to networked audio, and unlike many companies, RME is not quick to abandon technology. This means RME currently offers options for USB 2, USB 3, plus ADAT, MADI, AVB, and Dante. The preceding USB 2 Fireface UFX2 remains available as well. So what does one get with the Fireface UFX3 over the Fireface UFX2? In one word, more. The UFX3 boasts a higher channel count and expanded I.O. options, newly redesigned analog and digital boards, and a freshly designed RME USB 3 driver. The UFX3 is a fully class compliant USB 3 audio interface capable of an impressive 188 channels of audio. Out of the box, the UFX3 offers 12 analog inputs and 12 analog outputs. The expanded channel count can be fully realized with the addition of peripheral devices such as a remote preamp like the RME 12 mic or 12 mic D, the company's M series converters or any appropriately equipped third party option. Now, if you're thinking that the Fireface UFX3 looks familiar, that's because the UFX3 is visually indistinguishable from the previous UFX2. On the front, there's a quartet of XLR quarter inch combo inputs with LED indicators for signal, 48 volt phantom power, and TRS line selection. I'm told that the preamps are the same overall design across the entire RME line, most notably the RME 12 Mic D, which John Serwinski reviewed in the April 2023 issue, but with even better performance due to the newly developed analog and digital board. Other features on the front of the unit include a pair of fully independent headphone outputs that can double as additional line outputs, traditional 5-pin DIN MIDI I.O., and a USB 2 input socket that is used for the RME Direct function. Direct allows for direct, channel-for-channel, multi-track recording to any FAT32 formatted thumb drive or external hard drive. Basically, it turns any Direct-equipped RME device into a standalone multi-track recorder with no computer or DAW necessary. We previously explored the Direct feature in our video review of the RME Fireface UCX2, which you can also find here on Recording's YouTube channel. Direct records audio as broadcast WAV files that are split into successive files once a 2 gig limit is reached. These files are conveniently reconstructed and converted with the free RME multi-channel batch processor. You can then easily transfer the files to your DAW for editing and mixing. Moving back to the front of the unit, there's a collection of LED state lights. Sync is on the left, with MIDI monitoring on the right. Offering basic MIDI monitoring is a really nice touch. Lastly, on the front of the UFX3, you'll find a selection of push-button rotary encoders, function buttons, and a full-color LCD screen. These give you hands-on control of the digitally controlled microphone preamps and input levels, headphone output levels, mix routings, clock settings, tweaking of the onboard DSP, and more. The display defaults to peak RMS metering for every channel, clocking info, and the main output level. A large stepped push button rotary encoder and four function buttons help menu dive and adjust parameters. Two smaller push button rotary encoders also aid in navigation and default to headphone control. Nicely, this layout is similar to many other RME units in both the Fireface and ADI lines. This, of course, means if you can pilot one RME device, chances are you can fly them all. Now, let's take a look at the rear of the UFX3. Analog connections include eight TRS inputs, 
six TRS outputs, and a pair of balanced XLR outs. On the digital side, you get AES, Word Clock, MADI, and two pairs of ADAT optical I.O. There's also an additional set of MIDI ins and outs, a USB 3 output socket, a USB 2 remote input, and a three-prong IEC power socket. The UFX3 is not just for traditional audio, in fact, it loves synthesizers. The quarter-inch analog outputs are fully DC coupled, so they can carry control voltage signals to your favorite analog synths, both standard and Eurorack. This feature, along with the impressive MIDI implementation, makes the UFX3 a great choice for any synth-based studio, lessening the need for additional breakout boxes. Of course, for years, along with its reputation for rock-solid drivers, another RME fan favorite has been the DSP-based Total Mix software. Total Mix FX was one of the first software-controlled DSP-based mixing apps ever made, offering deep-level mixer-style control over the UFX3. This includes its DSP-based low-latency EQ, dynamics, and effects. And Total Mix FX is now available remotely on any iOS device, Mac, or PC that shares the same network as the main computer that your RME interface is connected to. Now you can adjust the preamp levels while seated at your drums, dial in your headphone mix from the vocal booth, change the effects levels from the listening couch. You get the idea. Of course, the other popular remote option is the RME Arc USB, essentially a USB-based button-equipped jog wheel with 15 fully programmable backlit buttons that you can configure in total mix. I found the ARC USB perfect for controlling the levels and functions of the microphone preamps, for quick controls of the headphone outputs and main volume, and the ARC USB can also function as a monitor controller. A great feature of the ARC USB is that it can be connected directly to the hardware or plugged into any USB port on your connected computer where it is instantly recognized. One final thing to note, in addition to Total Mix, and the RME DigiCheck software, the UFX3 currently comes with a special edition software bundle that includes Isotope Ozone Elements, three months of Antares Auto-Tune Limited, S-Gear Amp Simulation, Brainworks BX Opto Compressor and BX Master Desk, Gig Performer, GG Audio Blues 3 Virtual Organ, Modart Piano Tech 6, and the True Sound Studio RME Drum Sample Pack. The UFX3 is not only the sum of its parts, but it's also the sum of whatever else you decide to connect to it to take advantage of its impressive channel count. That said, having a 12 by 12 audio interface is pretty handy when compared to most other 8 by 8 audio interfaces on the market. It's also worth noting that when you use it with third-party ADAT expansion boxes or other digital gear, the RME Steady Clock FS technology keeps all of your digital connections beautifully in sync. Sonically, in use, I found that the preamps are clean and present, and the conversion is neutral and transparent. I actually found the preamps and converters to be a little less hard-edged than many similarly priced converters. But don't take my word for it. Let's check out the UFX3 in action. I invited singer-songwriter Scott McDonald over to the studio to sing and play some acoustic guitar. Jerry Bakash came over and played some bass, and then I added some drums and percussion. Let's listen. We're walking and it's summertime, skin like gold, your hand in mine, barefoot on the cracked black top. See your brother when he drives through town Music plays his window down He smiles, but he don't stop To the cool of the cedar trees Sailing for the blue and green Friends are laughing on the beach Waiting where it gets so deep Hold you close within my reach Tonight my dreams won't let me sleep Let me break it down for you baby Just open up your eyes and see Yeah I'm in love with you darling Just look 
aching to your heart, you find me. You find me. Driving on the east side, heading to the west side. Moon is rising on the lake. Some friends stop in up the road We just keep on rolling slow Make our way to Alloway Shadows dance around the fire Smoke takes us a little high Pointing out a shooting star Feelings we just can't translate Feel becomes the Milky Way Lying on the hood of my car Let me break it down for you, baby Just open up your eyes and see I'm in love with you, darling Just look into your heart, you find me Later on the runway grass, the heart is beating oh so fast. Beacon spins, you let me in. Now we're walking through the morning dew, no one else, just me and you. Kisses still taste like gin. And it's summertime Skin like gold, your hand in mine Barefoot on the cracked black top See your brother when it drives through town Music plays his window down He smiles, but he don't stop Let me break it down for you, baby Just open up your eyes and see So, what did you think? Let me know below in the comments. To my ears, the RME Fireface UFX3 is a great sounding, rock solid audio interface that more than holds its own in the professional audio interface and digital converter market. The magic of the Fireface UFX3 is its modular paradigm and robust collection of digital audio connection protocols and MIDI implementation, making the RME UFX3 a tremendous, expandable, and future-proof backbone of any modern studio setup. Plus, as its 27-year history has shown, RME devices have an excellent track record for longevity. If you'd like to learn more about the UFX3, stop by rme-usa.com for more. Also, be sure to check out my review in the June 2023 issue of Recording Magazine. If you liked this video, be sure to give us the thumbs up below and better yet, subscribe to Recording's YouTube channel for further video reviews, product comparisons, how-to videos, and more. Then, stop by recordingmag.com for the best in all things recording, where you can subscribe to our print publication, which is now in its 37th year. We'll see you soon.